Slowly but surely, reforms to the Vatican Curia are starting to take shape. For about a year now, the Pope's advisory council, which includes nine cardinals, have been looking at what needs to change and what could be done to make it happen. Their three-day meeting ended on September 17th. On the discussion list is how to reorganize the Vatican's 12 councils, which ultimately advise the Pope. According to the Vatican spokesperson, joining all the pontifical councils into two main groups is the leading option. One of the groups could deal with the laity and the family, which covers a lot of bases. It includes women's role in society and in the church, children, association, movements, and even the pastoral care of the family. The other main group would deal with peace and justice, which includes charity works, migrants, refugees, health, the defense of life, the ecology, and also human development. He also highlighted that the Council of Cardinals is an advisory group that can only pitch proposals to the Pope. Before making a decision, though, on the structure of the Curia, the Pope will consult other parties. The Council even prepared a rough draft on the new constitution that could govern the Roman Curia. The last constitution was approved 26 years ago. There is a rough draft and the Cardinals have talked about it. It is not the entire constitution, but what's important here is that they have begun to write it. The Council will continue to work on the draft for at least two more sessions, one on December 2014 and then the next on February 2015. If all goes as planned, the final text could be ready by midtime next year.